Robert Ogunde's family is set to translate some of the works of their patriarch to English language. The family also appealed to Southwest governors to assist them in resuscitating the abandoned film village established by their father, which had hosted many British filmmakers. TVC News Kazim Olowe was with the family at their country home in Ososa, Ijebu, and reports. The late Hiwat Ogunde was a man of many parts, a policeman, a poet, a musician, dramatist, and human rights activist. He was a pioneer of the Nigeria Moving Theatre and a strong promoter of Association of Nigeria Theatre Practitioners, ANTP. After two decades of his demise, his children and his surviving wives came up with the idea of Ogunde Museum at Ososa, and now they have decided to have some of his operas translated to English language. But as an artistic family, instead of engaging specialists to do the translation independently, they have decided to host a national competition for all Nigerians who are interested in translating the selected works to English language to participate with a grand prize of 500,000 Naira to be won by the best translator. The family is of the opinion that let this music, this opera, be translated even to English so that apart from our youths here and others, it will also travel across the boundaries, across the shores of this country. This is the essence of the competition, which the family has decided is to be opened to all and sundry. The, the present um, children that we have around, the present generation, many of them don't even know who Ogunde is. And um, we just thought it wise that just having the museum may not be enough. So we need to actually go out, publicize, and create a lot of awareness so that the new generations will know that there used to be somebody called Hubert Ogunde, the icon and the doyen of Nigerian theater. Speaking on the huge investment the man left behind and how some of his dreams and projects could have assisted in creating employment opportunities, the family warned the Southwest government to assist them in resuscitating the film village he left behind. We are calling on the Southwest governors to please assist Ogunde family, especially as concerns the film village, and to make sure that the museum, uh, the Hubert Ogunde Living History Museum, is can compete with other museums all over the world. Baba had laid the precedent, you know, we have a site that had even been used before and designated as a film village. But the government as usual take their time, but we know and we are hoping and praying that in our lifetime that will become a reality. The late Ogunde had 17 wives, 24 children and many grandchildren, Kazim Olowe. TVC News or Sosa, Ogun State.